The Martha Ray Show. Starring Martha Ray. An hour and a half of comedy, music, and dance. And now, The Martha Ray Show. With Edward G. Robinson, Cesar Romero, Rocky Graziano, The Herbert Ross Dancers, Walter Dare Wall, and John Crama. You know, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, I want you to meet a friend of mine, a wonderful comic. Here he is, Bart Law. Okay? Hiya, boy, hiya. <laughs> Look up in the water, play. <laughs> I'd like to walk amongst you personally and tell you how happy I am to be here. But time, time <laughs> prevents me. <laughs> am I having fun? Am I having fun? <laughs> Right, Law. And here, ladies and gentlemen, is that menace to the screen, little Caesar, Edward G. Robinson. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Now listen to you, I'm the boss, Molly, you see what I say go, see? Because I'm little Caesar, see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, get him! Oh, get him! Oh, get him. Get him. Let, let me run. at him, let me finish him off. Let me at him! Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, please forgive me, but I, I can't take these imitations any longer. <laughs> you know, more than 20 years ago, I made a picture called Little Caesar. And ever since then, the imitations have been going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Since then, I've made hundreds of pictures, wonderful pictures, like Dr. Ehrlich's Magic Bullet, where I played a nice, sweet, lovable German scientist. But the people, people imitate Dr. Ehrlich? No. I turn on the radio, what do I hear? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody on television. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the day... The day my little baby was born. The first time that I picked him up in my arms. All other babies say, Goo goo. Dad, dad. He looked up at me and he said, Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm no gangster. 
I love everybody, and I want everybody to love me. <laughs> Mr. Robinson, everybody loves you. Uh, Let's hear it. How about... For he's a jolly good fellow, for he's a jolly good fellow, for he's a jolly good fellow. What's going on? I heard screaming. It's nothing, Clancy. Oh, no, no, nothing. We're just having a little fun, officer. That's all. Well, I... It's little Caesar. Right now, Mr. Robinson, your friend is here. You can take him home now, Mr. Romero. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, Eddie. Huh? Eddie, Eddie, what? speak to me. It's me, Caesar. Caesar Romero. Oh, it's you, Romero. Eddie, what happened? It happened again. Eh? You ran into another image. When is it going to end? When are they going to stop imitating oh, me? Oh, no, sit down, Eddie. It's all right. Take it easy now. Here, here. <laughs> I am it's Dr. Right. Howell. I was about to make a call on 2nd Avenue, but yes. the sergeant asked me to come. Wait! <laughs> I know you! <laughs> no, no, I'm not. Caesar, I'm not. Wait, 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 Somebody remembers Dr. Ehrlich. Well, of course, Eddie. It's your greatest <laughs> role. Oh, you will always be Dr. Ehrlich mm. to me. The kindly, gentle little German doctor yeah. with his wife, Hilda, at mm. work in the laboratory with his monkeys and mice. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Here's Dr. Ehrlich. <laughs> doctor, come with me, will you yes, please? Yes, how everybody loved Dr. Ehrlich. Dr. Howe? Are you Dr. Howe? Ah, oh, no, no, uh, I'm Dr. Ellie. Oh, sorry, Doc. Well, I am. Dr. Howe? <laughs> well, I must go home now. My wife, Hilda, is waiting for me. Yeah, and the monkeys. Uh, my monkeys, Hans, Carl, and Fritz. I mustn't keep them waiting, yeah. And the mice. I... Yeah, but where do I live? Ah, so many experiments are in my mind, I forget. Ah, here it is written. 124 Zegen Avenue. Yeah, that must be the place. <laughs> Ach, mein Papa, to me you were so wonderful. Take my hand, I persuade you can never die. <laughs> oh, God, I don't want to tell. Well, oh, we're going to tell it now. Tell it. What is <laughs> oh, what a miserable cold I got. I got a cold in my head. I'm going crazy working in... That must be the phone. That's right. I'll be right there. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. Hey, hold up. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I don't... I don't... I don't... Don't, don't go by. I can't go out with you. I got a cold in my nose. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm waiting for the doctor now. Come in. That must be the doctor now. Ah, my papa. <laughs> that time of the doctor, Eddie Fisher sure gained weight. <laughs> Bye. Oh, gosh, doctor. I'm awful glad you came. I got such a terrible cold. Ah, it's good to be home. Where was I going to be with this miserable cold in my head? Mm. I get AIDS all over. My, my throat feels like sandpaper. Oh, my <laughs> poor Hilda. Yeah, I... <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure you're from Blue Cross? <laughs> better already. <laughs> also, let us get to work. Yeah, yeah. Ah! Uh, uh, ah! Did you, did you feed the monkeys? The monkeys? Will you pull everything the fence out of the monkeys? Feed the monkeys! Feed the monkeys! 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 Here, here are the monkeys. Where are the monkeys? Here, here are the monkeys. Look at them. <laughs> oh, yeah, there are the monkeys. Uh, 
This must be the place, Paul. <laughs> Hans looks very much better today, huh? Oh, yeah, Paul, he looks very good. He must have had a good night's sleep. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Ah, <laughs> uh, poor Carl. I don't like the way he looks. Yeah, poor Do Carl. I, I, I think he needs a shave. No. <laughs> Please! Yeah, Hilda! Hilda, put down Fritz! Put down Fritz! Oh, don't do it! See the way he looks at you. Go on, say something nice to yeah. Fritz, please. Yeah, say something nice. Say something hello, nice. Hello, 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 Fritz. Please! Hilda! The mice! The mice! The mice! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I tell the landlord. Hilda, Hilda, come here. Give me a calm down. Oh, I'm so nervous, I don't know what is happening to me. You're so nervous. Please sit down here myself. like you used to. Yeah, yeah, Put me to sleep. Here, here, here the paper. Maybe, maybe this will help a little yeah, bit. Yeah, 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 Please read, read the paper. Sorry, I read the paper, yeah, I read yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, my little <laughs> What do you know? Look at the headline. Yeah, what? It says, Ever G. Robinson slugs cop. He reverts back to Little Caesar. Little Caesar. Yeah, you know, Little Caesar, the guy says, I listen here, you guys. I'm the boss around here, see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's what... Yeah, that's what... That a picture on the paper, huh? Three, two. Yeah, little Caesar, that's me. <laughs> Getting to be a big shot in this town, hey, Mabel? Mabel? Oh, yeah, yeah, Mabel, I, I mean, yeah, 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 Mabel, yeah. Yeah, come here. <laughs> I want you to meet the, I want you to meet the mob. The mob? Yeah, shake hands with little Otero. What? Oh, shake hands with little Otero. Yeah, shake hands. Hello, little Otero. <laughs> Say hello to Big Eddie. Right up there. Hey. Yeah, he's the tall one, isn't he? Hello, Big Eddie. Okay, you guys, now listen. We're going to knock off Little Arnie's joint tonight. Now get in the car. Yeah. Big Eddie, you sit over here. Yeah, little old Tony, come in the back seat. Yeah, you're back there. Okay, let's go. Well, good luck, boys. Yeah, come back. <laughs> well, I don't know how to drive. Yeah, I'm driving. Yeah, we're knocking off Little Arnie's joint tonight, and then the town will be ours. Yeah, I'm driving. Here. <clears throat> What's that? What's what? Police car. Police car. Step on it. I'm stepping on it. They're shooting at us. Watch out. I'm watching. I'm... Turn right. Turn I'm left. I'm turning right. Turn right. Yeah, douse the light. Douse the light. Back up. Back up. Stop. <laughs> they got Big Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> Big Eddie. Talk to me. Talk to me. He's dead. Here, yeah, take his body and hide him. <laughs> well, 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 where did I put him? I'll put him anywhere. Yes, sir. Crush poor little Hans. Yes. Yeah, poor little Hans. You poor crushed him. Hans. Oh, see, he was such a cute monkey. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Please. Here. Here, look, look, he's moving. He's opening his eyes. You see that? <laughs> Maybe he's got a little bread. <laughs> yeah. Can we oh, try it? Oh, and look. Yeah. He's this still is breathing. Hans is alive. Hans is alive. Hans is alive. Hans is alive. Let's dance, huh? Well, certainly anything, sir. You're the boss. Yeah, I'm the boss. Yeah, I'm the boss. Go on, get in. Yeah, I'm driving. Okay, I'm driving. Well, I'm step driving. on you. Yeah, they got spaghetti, but they ain't going to get me. He <laughs> was... Now, nah, wait a minute. I'll come to a cop's there when we stop. Cop? Yeah, you squeal. <laughs> you're at it. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to... Hey, watch out. Oh, you ran over Fritz. You <laughs> ran over Fritz. Don't worry, we'll bury him with Big Eddie. Big Eddie. <laughs> oh, I mean, I mean, I, I was only kidding. I'll tell you what, let's relax and watch television. Yeah. Tonight, Saturday night, they got a wonderful uh, show, Show of Shows, uh, and yeah. it's starring Emma Jean Coker uh, and Sid... Sid who? <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm driving. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, where was I? Where were you? Yeah, where was I? Uh, well, let's see. And well, I'll be right with you. Yeah. Came out and said, oh, yeah. yeah. Said, Hello, please, please. Yeah. Mrs. Fritz, he looks good. Yeah, he's still breathing. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I'm going out to get a little lardy. And after that, I'm coming back and I'm going to get you, baby. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, gosh. Hello. Hello, please. Quick, come to my apartment. There's lots of news. Who, who's there? It's me, Caesar. Open up. See, what did they die on? Who, ow, wow. Oh, did they just, just met a Caesar. I, don't go away. <laughs> Well, this is the address they gave me. Oh. <laughs> well, that's the end of little Caesar. Oh, gosh, it's Big Caesar. Uh, Mr. Romero. What happened? Where am I? I'll tell you where you are. You're lying on little Fritz. Uh, I mean... <laughs> all right now, Mr. Really. Robinson, you cannot be allowed to leave Miss Ray's apartment. Edward G. Robinson? Oh, young lady, I, I owe you an apology, really. That's all right. Oh, uh... Miss Ray, come over here for a second. Yes, sir. Anything you want, Mr. Robinson. Good work, Mabel. I see you got a little Arnie. <laughs> yes. Too bad the Big Eddie isn't alive to see it. Rah, yeah. rah, rah. Yeah. Sorry, Mr. Romero. How's your headache? Uh, how's your headache, Mr. Romero? How's your headache? Hey! <laughs> my head is killing me. Well, that must be my boyfriend. Oh, uh, never mind. I'll get it. Yes, sir. Okay. Hello, Martha Ray's apartment. What do you mean, what's a man doing here? I happen to be staying here for a few days. <laughs> Will you stop shouting? Martha? Yes, yeah, she's here. She's in the bedroom with Eddie. What? <laughs> See, I was in the bedroom with Eddie, and I... Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> well, let me explain, Mark. You see... Yeah, but... Uh, I, I, uh, are you... Uh, quiet! Oh, please, for heaven's sake, I've got a headache. I'm sorry, it's my boyfriend. Give me that thing. My boyfriend is very jealous. I'll take care of him. But he's very... Now, listen, whoever you are, it just so happens that Eddie and I and Martha have to share this place, and if you don't like it, you know what you can do. Will you shut up? And here's one more thing, Mr... Hey, what's this jerk's name? Graziano. Mr. Gaziano? <laughs> Rocky Graziano. Rocky. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 when you hear the tone, it'll be exactly time for me to get out. Romero, <laughs> no matter where you going? I'm going around the corner, checking into the YMCA. If you're smart, you'll join me. Look, look, really, you need a rest. No, 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 I feel wonderful, really, oh, I Oh, please, do. look, for your sake and for mine, yeah. I've got to get out of here. No, 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 please, please. No, look, please. I have a good idea. There's a YWCA just yeah. around the corner. I'll go and check in there, and we'll all be satisfied, okay? Well, Bye. I love you. I love you. Second Avenue, YMCA. Thank you. Yes, we have plenty of rooms. Sign right there, sir. Cesar Romero, welcome to the YMCA. You going to stay a while? No, just for the night. I've got a terrible headache. All right, here you are, room number six. Nice shower, steam room, that'll fix you up. Yes, I certainly hope so. Excuse me, I'd like a room. Miss, you can't come here. This is the YMCA. What you want is the YWCA next door. Uh-oh, the YW sign is off again. I better call them right away. She must have been in a hurry. <laughs> well, where's the lady I can check in with? Honey? Honey? Oh, well, I'll check in as I'm checking out. What a dumb, da 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 There. It's on again now. Welcome to the YMCA sign right here. Well, I feel better already. Ah. Oh. Now for a nice steam. Gotta dump. What a gotta da da dump. Well, gotta da da dump. I must change the paradigm. Da 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 dump. What gotta dump dump.
everybody. He's clear. I sure got out of that part in time. See, getting caught with Rocky Graziano's girl. No, thank you too much. Oh, boy, I can hardly keep my eyes open. Well, now for a nice sleep. Oh. Babu? Oh. I got a roommate. Why oh, can't you get a long one? <laughs> <laughs> she must be a real high-class girl. She belongs to the aftershave club. <laughs> aftershave. Well, a little should I? <laughs> Boy, I would get a snore. Well, off we go into the wild wood yonder. Why you spy? Into the sky. Good night, honey. <laughs> 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 what a good job. You're right, right, Graziano, right. Rocky Graziano. Yeah, yeah. How do you do? Yeah, yeah. Hey, that looks familiar. Oh, no. No, no, that's, that's mine. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't that cute? Well, we're in a good health. I think I hit the hay. Yeah, oh, Mr. Graziano, how about some basketball, some squash, or baseball, huh? Uh, a few rounds of boxing. Ooh, what am I saying? No, some dominoes, scrabble. Just name it, I'll do it. No, thanks, Mr. Murrow. I gotta beat up a couple of guys, Eddie and his friend at the bottom of my girl, Martha. Oh, yeah, well, all right. Oh, no, Mr. Graziano, please, take my bed. I'm checking out right now. Go ahead, get right in there, cover yourself up. Have a nice, nice rest. Rock, goodbye, Rocky. I mean, <laughs> you don't want to go up there. The air's too thin. You get the bends. <laughs> <laughs> nice guy. Wow! She's really blasting. <laughs> I gotta get back and go to work. Hi, Gachi. This is wonderful. You see, I had a steam and a shower in the YMCA. I, I, YMCA! Wow! Stay tuned for the Martha Ray Show with her guests, Edward G. Robinson, Cesar Romero, Rocky Graziano, Walter Dayerwald, and the Herbert Ross Dancers. The Martha Ray Show will continue after a brief pause for station identification. Brought to you by Benarest Watches, Griffin Shoe Polishes, and Adolph's Meat Tenderizer.
Mr. Robinson, honestly, I took the imitation of Little Caesar out of my eyes. Well, thank do you, it. thank you. Don't worry, I'm perfectly all right now, as long as I don't have to meet up with the imitations. Oh, we have more time. Oh, 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 everybody oh, does. Oh, 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 oh. Whoops. Now, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm perfectly all right now. Where's Martha? Martha, I'll call her. Hmm? Oh, there she is, Maggie. Oh. Oh, Mr. Robinson, what are you doing out of my apartment? Well, the doctor said I could have a night out. And Martha, I'm taking you out tonight for the most wonderful, exciting night you've ever had in your life. Oh, gosh. Where to? The, the El Morocco or, or the Latin Quarter? No, the Metropolitan Museum of Art. Well, that's one of those new joints, huh? Do they have a floor show? Just imagine, tonight they're unveiling the Aphrodite of Athens. Oh, well, one of those kind of joints, huh? <laughs> Look, Mr. Robinson, you got to be careful of those Greek strippers. Aphrodite of Athens is a priceless picture. It's worth millions. You know, uh, that's why it only just arrived in this country, and that's why I got here, you to New York, because art is my whole life. Oh, art? Oh, well, gee, that, that's much too high class for me, Mr. Robinson. Oh, no, 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 nothing's too high class for you, Martha. Oh. Didn't you give me back my sanity? Oh. Why, well, I, I only try to help you, you know. Oh. I just try to give you a bed and a room and... and... Oh, no, no. We're going to spend a wonderful night together. At last, I'm going to be face to face with an old Greek masterpiece. Well, right now, get face to face with a young Italian masterpiece. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Eddie. Eddie, the guy in the bedroom where, why are oh, you? Wait, 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 Rocky, Rocky. But, you know, you don't understand, he's a very sick man. This is Edward G. Robinson. Yeah. You're kidding. No, I'm not oh, as good as him. right, I am. Yeah. Gosh, Edward G. Robinson? Yeah, Goomba. My idol of the silver screen? <laughs> really? You're acquainted with my work? Am I? Watch this. Listen here, you guys. I'm the boss, see? I'm the boss of the star, see? No, no. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. I'm little Caesar. You're little Caesar. I'm little Caesar. There ain't room for both of us in this town. One of us got to go in. Mr. Robinson. Out of the way. Out of the way. I'm driving. I'm driving. Oh, squeeze. Get it. Get it. That's my gun you're pushing around. Oh, stop that, you idiot. This man. Oh, it's you, Rocky. How about little Caesar? Yeah, but this guy is. Wait, Goomba, come here. Look, let me tell you something. That really is. That's really Ever G. Robinson. I know, but he acts more like Sugar Ray. <laughs> all right, Eddie. Sit down. Take it easy. It's all over. All right. All right. Guys. I belong to your fan club. I belong to your fan club, too. All right. I'm president of the Brown chapter. The two oh, good. Club. Well, thank you very much, girls. Thank Excuse me. My friend is ill. Thank you very oh, much. Oh, a fan club. It must be wonderful to have a fan club. People oh. who worship you, who idolize you. Oh, Eddie, it's nothing. Now, oh. don't let it worry you. A fan club. Youngsters who love you. Are you gentlemen with the party in the banquet room upstairs? Oh, no, no. Oh, it started already. It's the annual meeting of the Edward G. Robinson Fan Club. What's that? A fan club? I have a fan club? Oh, hurry up, Eddie. Go on up there. This is just what you needed. A fan yeah. club? The kiddies remember me. <laughs> the kiddies remember me. Gentlemen. Oh, Edward G. Oh, Edward G. We pledge our loyalty. Oh, Edward G. Oh, Edward G. Forever in our memory. You taught us how to shoot a get. The way to kill a diamond rat. Oh, Edward G, oh, Edward G, to thee we pledge our loyalty. Oh, take it easy, Spike. We all feel the same way. Wait, somebody's at the door. <laughs> it's me, kiddies. <laughs> oh, no. Boys! It's the boss himself! Oh, oh Edward G! Oh, Edward G! Oh, the we play Hey, guys, quiet. What's this thing all about? This is the 20th anniversary of the Edward G. Robinson Fan Club. We meet once a year to plan a big robbery in your memory. Oh. <laughs> 
day and you show up at one of our meetings to give you this. It's a match set of solid gold sawed-off shotgun. <laughs> it's inscribed. To little Caesar, the man who showed us that crime does pay. What's the matter, boss? Oh. Too heavy? Should we saw a little more off? No, oh, idiots. <laughs> Fools. So this is the tribute to my memory. A robbery once a year. Well, we got three million dollars in the treasury. Oh, no. It's a pension fund for when we're too old to carry a gun. <laughs> now, I know that my career has been an absolute failure. How can I ever look at beauty again after what has happened to me here tonight? How can I ever enjoy the priceless beauty of the Aphrodite of Athens at the Metropolitan Museum of Art with this blood on my name? A fan club. <laughs> A fan club. <laughs> A fan club. <laughs> well, boys, now we know what the boss wants. What he said was? The Metropolitan Museum of Art. <laughs> well, boys, what are we waiting for? <laughs> Hello there. There. Are you sure this is where Edward G. is staying? Yeah, yeah, I checked with the police station. What's a boss want with this hunk of plaster? Ah, not the reason why. He wanted it, he got it. Wait, somebody's coming. Out the back way, quick. Oh, what a day. Oh, it happened at last. I'm engaged. Oh, I'm so happy. Rocky, he finally put a ring on my finger. Oh, I can't tell you how happy I am. It's a wonderful a girl feeling this way when she's engaged. You'll never know. Oh, God. <laughs> she's lovely. She's engaged. She wears Griffin shoe polish. <laughs> <laughs> and soon I'm going to be Mrs. Rocky Graziano. And I will say that lasagna. That's Rocky. Oh, I mean, excuse me. It must be my fiancé. <laughs> Where did you hide the statue? Come on, let me spill it. You know where it is. We want to know. Give us the things go easy with you. All right, tell us. Just tell us where the statue is. You get off for only ten years. What statue? The Aphrodite of Athens. Where is it? It's the picture of it. Please, I'm engaged. Then Anita's robbing you. Me? Listen, I'm going to tell my boyfriend Rocky Jr. Shut up! Get out of here! Look, I know my rights. I see Dragnet. I know how to make one phone call, and I'm going to call Rocky. He'll take care of you guys. He's here right now. Let me go. Oh, no, wait, I'm wait, the boss around here. He's gone. He's working. He's working. Let me go. Let me go. Hey, look, look. The cops are in the kitchen. The cops. Let me get out. the police. Let's see if this gets my again. He's ruined. Oh, you better me. stall him off. All right, I'll go. All right, run it out on me, eh? No, I'm talking about it. Come on, come on. Yeah, all right. Come on now. I got a flat. Huh? We want to talk to you. Here we go. Here we go. You know what I'm You know what I'm talking about. Come on. 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 Come Oh, Goomba, I'm so glad to see you. I'm in so Don't much trouble. Don't worry about a thing, Martha. But, Rocky, the cops are in there. I have a surprise for you. I don't need a surprise. I got a surprise for it's you. the family. Martha, Martha, Villa Mia, come to the Watch out where you're going. 
mind. Watch yeah. out for okay, the cops. Okay, boss. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's all right. Look out. Me, 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 me. Me. Who's Big Eric? Big Eric, he's dead. Dead? Where's the body? On little Fritz. On our dead somewhere. I'll be right out. Right back. Oh. Okay. Mabel, dry, will you? I'm done, I'm driving, driving. All right, Eddie, take it easy now. Take it easy. Oh, no! Anything of yours. Mabel! Oh, no! Fight down, you mugs, or I'll let you have it. What are these guys doing here? All right, all right, everybody! Oh, oh, Ralph, please, Rocky, don't be upset. Please, let me explain, Goomba. Ma Martha Ray, this is a pre of My family, the Grazianos, and the can. <laughs> That's all I'm worried about. What about me? Getting tied up with everybody pushing me around and everything? If that's the way you feel about it, Rock, won't even let me explain. Here's your ring back. Here's your ring back. Here. For Martha. Now go. G-O-E. Go. Gosh. That's the shortest engagement I ever had. Didn't even give my finger a chance to turn green. Yeah, oh, this joint is bad luck to me. I'm gonna hit the road. First I get mixed up with a couple of nuts. And then Rocky, my goomba, leaves me. What more trouble can I have? <laughs> alpha, 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 I, for heaven's sakes, put something on. Rocky, what's the matter with you? What do you want now? You, you got my ring and everything, didn't you? But Martha... Don't touch me. I'm sorry, Martha. You're sorry, Rocky. I love you so much, but yet you couldn't care. You, all, all you worried about was a supreme insult to your family. My family loves you, Martha. Honest, Goomba. You mean... You mean they, they aren't mad at me because they spent the night in jail? Are you kidding? The party got better there. <laughs> really? Yeah, we ran at the relatives we didn't see in years. <laughs> oh, God, Scuba, I love you. I... Oh, look, Rocky, you've got to get out of here. i got to get rid of the statue. Hey, is that the Greek dame that was snatched? Yeah, but i got to get it back. Don't worry about a thing, Martha. I'll get a couple of guys. We'll get it back for you. Oh, thank you, Goomba. Gosh. I forgot something. Here's your ring back. Thank you, Rocky. Gee. Oh, it's an inscribed, too. It says to, to Martha from Rocky, under the auspices of the New York State Athletic Commission. <laughs> That's my boo that said that. Someday, you come along, the man I love, and he'll be big and strong, the man I love, and when he comes my way, I'll do my best to make him stay, make him stay, stay on, stay on. me and smile, ah, 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 I'll understand, and in a little while, he'll take my hand, and though it seems 
say they took the statue in this place here? Yes, the Aphrodite of Athens was to be unveiled right here. I can't understand how they did it. Now, nah, take it easy, Professor. Yes, but if they could steal the Aphrodite from under our noses, they could steal our entire collection. Now, don't worry. We got the place entirely surrounded. No one can get in or out. Come on, let's check. Remember, man, shoot first. Nobody's in here, boss. Well, check every room. I'm sure there's somebody in here. Let's go. Wait. Are you sure this is the room the Aphrodite was in? This looks like the room the statue of the fight for Helena Troy was. Oh, no, that's in the next room. Let's check. Let's go. But wait. There was something most peculiar about that statue. Yeah? I don't think it was the fight for Helen of Troy at all. It looked more like the wounded warrior. The wounded warrior. Let's check. Professor, the wounded warrior. Boy, those great sure could build statues. Let's go. 
Wait! <laughs> there was something most peculiar about that statue. You know, I noticed that too. You know something, Professor? That looked to me like the retreat from Sparta. The retreat from Sparta? Let's check. <laughs> Right, the retreat from spot. The retreat from... Wait! <laughs> I am positive that this is the room in which we have the Venus de Milo. You sure, Professor? Yes. Let's check. Milo. Boy, ain't she beautiful. She's three thousand years old. <laughs> she looks almost alive. Hey, you know it's cold in here. A work of art. The classic in marble. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's go. Aren't you? Oh, it's a I knew you were the crook. Here's the rest of the gang, Sergeant. Here they are. Edward G. Robinson. She's a Romero. Oh, I'm sorry to have troubled you, gentlemen. Come on, you. Wait. No, wait. Is this the way to treat the young lady that's responsible for the return of the Aphrodite of Athens? The Aphrodite? Well, here she is. Here. Why, it is the Aphrodite. They brought it back. I've called the committee. Well, at last. I'm, I'm sorry, miss. We owe you I'm an apology. close to Aphrodite. Oh, Isn't that isn't wonderful? She beautiful? <laughs> but you know something, Martha? What? You're more wonderful than the statue. Oh, no. You want to know why? Why? Let's tell her, fellas. <laughs> You've got that thing, that certain thing. Get the same car. you got that thing, that certain thing. What? Da -da 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 that charm. Charm. That makes the farmers certain the farm. Guys, you got, got that thing. Well, that certain thing. And whenever you were daddy of mine, you've got what Adam and Rainbow when with Eve he was in love. She only had an apple tree. But well, you, you you've got an orchard. Those charms are way. But they made the party ache for a wedding ring. of the Martha Ray Show has been brought to you by Benrus Watches, Griffin Shoe Polishes, and Adolph's Meat Tenderizer.
Stay tuned for the Martha Ray Show, which will continue after a brief pause for station identification.